tour alongside Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to the State Palace Theater here in beautiful... When you get a fight like this that everybody's been talking about, it's always so interesting to see these opening moments here in round number one. Morrison's cheek is cut. You can see it's opening up now. Boy, that could be a factor later on. Teddy, what do you look for early on when you're analyzing a fight of two power punchers facing off against each other that gives you a clue as to which way this is going? Who's doing the little things a little bit better? Who's using the jab? Who's controlling range? Hey, who's thinking better? Move your heads. Parries that punch intended for the head. You see how effective Chris Areola can be when he lands that one-two? Morrison's cracked by a right hand. Wow! And a big punch puts him down. of a flash knockdown there. You can see he's not too damaged. His opponent better be careful. He's still got a live guy opposite. Oh, yeah, he definitely does. And believe me, the buzz indicated that he didn't really hurt him. His opponent's not coming after him. He knows that he's okay. He knows that that wasn't one of those big shots that really debilitates a guy. Teddy, he did a smart thing right there. Just created enough space and then landed the punch. Looked like the will of the wish, the old great Willie Peck. Made him miss, made him pay. Oh, and he comes back with an uppercut there after getting hit. Right hand downstairs. Able to show you his blocking ability. That is a big right hand after eating one himself. of round one. Morrison's corner has to keep him calm. That's the kind of cut that can send a fighter into fits. Yeah, and a corner man into using crazy glue instead of adrenaline. I mean, that is a scary cut, as you just said. Hits him in the mug with the right. A headshot blocked. Of a very good counter punch. Accurate hook by Tommy Morrison. Morrison's got the mentality right Watch now of fine. Bombs away. He went down earlier, and now he sees this as his only way of getting back in this fight. Yeah, he's behaving like a guy out in the street. And that's okay for a guy out in the street. You get desperate, you act a little amateurish, you just start throwing bombs, hoping to get rid of the guy. But it's not okay if you're a professional fighter. He's going to pay a price for this. Well, you can see what he wanted to do there, but unable to land that body shot. Morrison scoring with that right hand. left by Tommy Morrison. Thought he had his target, but way off to the side with the uppercut. Wow, what an uppercut. Ten seconds to go in this round. a big uppercut that just crashed home. And we come to the end of round number two. Ariola's performance tonight has to please all of his backers. He has been scoring from the outside. That was the game plan coming in. He understood from the beginning that he had that great wingspan, that great advantage of length. That uppercut tapped, and yet another big shot comes in. And he goes down for a second time. Does he have enough this time to rise up and continue on?
Morrison's up from the knockdown, but what we really want to look for is how he reacts in the coming moments of this fight. That's a solid right hand by Tommy Morrison. He had his eyes set on the uppercut, but was unable to land it. Effective work with that flush overhand right. All right, something's seriously wrong here, Teddy. It's early on in the fight. Morrison's conditioning is already showing us that he's nowhere near being able to be in this fight. Well, that showed me that he gave up before this fight ever started. And somebody's got to tell him in his corner, you know what? It's harder to quit than it is to fight because you got to live with the results of that quitting. Didn't get it done going to the body there. Good combination to the body. Big right hand. Big shot there. Forget about the judges. This one may be over now. Morrison's down, and he looks like he's in bad shape. When you fall that way, you usually don't get up. One, two, three, four, five. And that's it. What a way to end the night with a knockout. You saw it coming. Problem is, he didn't see it. To cap it all, we send it up to the ring. Oh, that's a big win. That's a big win that's going to get everybody in the division's attention.